Suspected gang member is on trial right now for murder, charged in the shooting death of an Escondido woman who was leaving church last year when she was hit in the head by a stray bullet. 10 News anchor Mary McKenzie has been in court listening to opening statements for a trial that could go on for weeks. We won't be able to record the testimony of any of the witnesses against Dionisio Torres Jr. The prosecutor says many of them are just too fearful of possible gang retaliation. That route put her in a completely different world, a very violent world, and a world that she had no idea she was getting into, a world that she never made it out of. That's the prosecutor talking about the night of March 7th in 2017 when Kathy Kennedy was driving home from Bible study. She made a detour from her direct route home, which put her on Grand Avenue, where prosecutor Lori Koff says she got caught in the middle of a gang war over turf. The defendant described as a senior member of one gang retaliating against rivals by firing 12 shots at their getaway car after they tagged the apartment complex considered a stronghold by Torres's gang. Now she talked about witnesses being so scared to testify about what they saw that night, but also mentioned surveillance video, cell phone and forensic evidence that will corroborate witness testimony. Torres is facing life in prison without the possibility of parole because of those additional gang circumstances. We're live in Mary McKenzie, 10 News.